Welcome back to Modern Agri Machines. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of asparagus, a vegetable celebrated for its distinct taste and incredible nutritional value. Join us as we explore its origins, the regions where it's grown, its economic impact, and the rigorous, and the rigorous yet rewarding process that brings asparagus from the farm to our tables. Asparagus is one of the oldest cultivated vegetables with origins tracing back to over 2,000 years ago in the Mediterranean regions of Europe, Northern Africa, and parts of Asia. It's even referenced in ancient Egyptian text, prized by the Romans, and was widely grown in Europe by the 16th century. Today, this perennial vegetable is grown and enjoyed across the globe. Today, some of the largest asparagus producing regions are in the United States, Peru, China, Germany, and Spain. In the US, California, Washington, and Michigan are the top producers. Globally, the asparagus industry is valued at over $20 billion, reflecting its importance to farmers, exporters, and food industries. This crop brings immense value, especially to rural communities, creating jobs and providing a steady income. Asparagus is a nutrient-dense vegetable rich in vitamins and minerals, known for its numerous health benefits. It contains high levels of vitamins A, C, E, K, and is especially rich in folic acid, essential for cell health and vital for fetal development. Asparagus is also high in fiber, which aids digestion and prevents constipation. This vegetable is a powerful source of antioxidants, which help protect cells from damage caused by free radicals, reducing the risk of chronic diseases. Minerals like potassium and asparagus help regulate blood pressure and support heart health. Another highlight is its low calorie content and lack of cholesterol, making it ideal for those looking to maintain weight or improve their diet. With a low glycemic index, asparagus is a safe choice for those managing diabetes. Not only does it provide nutritional benefits, but it also boosts immunity and contributes to overall health when regularly incorporated into a balanced diet. Preparing the soil, making raised beds, and planting asparagus are essential steps to ensure the plants grow strong and productive. Asparagus thrives in well-draining, loose soil rich in nutrients with a pH of 6.5 to 7.5, preferring a slightly alkaline environment. Before planting, farmers should till the soil to a depth of 30, 40 centimeters and add decomposed organic matter to improve fertility. Creating raised beds is also crucial. These beds should be 20, 30 centimeters high and one 1.5 milliliters wide to prevent root water logging and improve drainage during heavy rains. Between each bed, a drainage channel of 30, 40 centimeters should be established to prevent water accumulation. There are two common ways to plant asparagus, using roots and using seedlings. When planting roots, farmers dig holes 10, 15 centimeters deep on the beds, place the asparagus roots inside, cover lightly with soil, and water gently to keep the soil moist. Currently, many farms have adopted machinery for planting asparagus by root to increase labor productivity and economic efficiency. For seed planting, seeds are first germinated in nursery trays with loose potting soil. After eight, 10 weeks, when the seedlings reach 10 to 15 centimeters in height and have two turn to three leaves, they can be transplanted into the beds. In both cases, the soil should be kept consistently moist, but not waterlogged to support stable asparagus growth. Harvesting asparagus is a meticulous process as the quality of asparagus significantly impacts its market value. Although there are machines available to aid in this task, most asparagus harvesting is still done by hand, particularly on small and medium-sized farms. Manual harvesting remains the most common method due to its flexibility and precision. Farmers typically harvest in the early morning or late afternoon when cooler temperatures help maintain the asparagus's freshness. They select spears that reach about 20, 25 centimeters in height, 
with an appropriate thickness, cutting close to the base to avoid damaging the plant and allowing it to keep growing. Manual harvesting enables workers to carefully observe and select only the spears that meet quality standards. Mechanical harvesting is used on some large-scale farms or when extensive harvesting is required, especially if labor resources are limited. Asparagus harvesters are designed with cutting and collection mechanisms that allow them to move along the rows, trimming the spears at a set height, and collecting them in a storage bin. However, mechanical harvesters often struggle to match the consistency and accuracy of hand harvesting. Machines lack the flexibility to select only the best quality spears, which can impact the final product. In conclusion, while technology is advancing, hand harvesting remains the preferred method for asparagus, especially where quality and uniformity are priorities. After harvesting, asparagus undergoes a careful process to ensure that it reaches the market in the best possible condition. Freshly harvested asparagus is first taken to a processing area where it's thoroughly washed to remove any soil, pesticides, and other residues. Typically, this process involves soaking and spraying the asparagus with clean, cool water. Once clean, the asparagus is sorted by size, color, and quality. Grading machines, or in some cases, skilled workers, Assess the asparagus based on criteria such as thickness, length, and the absence of blemishes. Spear tips that are tightly closed, vibrant in color, and of uniform thickness are typically graded as premium, while others are designated for secondary markets. Sorting is important not only for appearance, but also for pricing and to meet specific customer demands. After grading, the asparagus is carefully packed into suitable containers typically in bunches tied with rubber bands or placed in trays. Packaging often includes moisture-retaining pads to maintain freshness during transit. In some cases, asparagus is packed in modified atmosphere packaging to prolong shelf life. The packaging design, including clear labeling and sometimes even branding, helps attract buyers while providing necessary information about the product. Overall, these steps ensure that the asparagus arrives at its destination fresh, appealing, and ready for consumers. The attention to detail in each part of the process helps maintain the quality, ensuring that consumers receive a product that's both delicious and visually appealing. Thank you for watching our video on the Modern Agri Machines channel. We hope this video has given you a clearer understanding of the process of growing, harvesting, and packaging asparagus. Don't forget to hit like, and subscribe so you won't miss other exciting content on modern agriculture. See you in our next videos.